Good morning, this is Jeff of Sewer Tech Northwest. We're at 3592 Northeast 218th here in Fairview. It's the second video, I accidentally knocked my tablet over there a second ago and it magically landed on the power button. So that video file is done. Anyway, the line is just about done draining off here. That file did save, so I've got both the advance out and coming back in, just on two different videos. So located the camera there on 218th. Line ends up running down the driveway all said and done down that left side panel. And the pipe is just about done draining out here. There's just a tiny little trickle moving through the pipe. But anyway, you can see there's a, I was just talking about a little bit of grease there as we were coming down the line. You're, you're about the only stuff I could even call slightly notable is almost 100 feet out from the house there. That's a long ways away from eating cleaning. It's very, very minor. But if you put a lot of cooking oil and grease down your line, your whole entire line can look like that, if not significantly worse. Relative to this line, that's the most significant part of or grease buildup in the line. Relative to most homes, that, that's like par for the course what most houses look like end to end. That gives you an idea how clean this thing is. You can see that water is still draining off there. It's just a trickle. I'm not sure if the dishwasher turned on or something like that, but there's just a little bit moving to the pipe right now. None of that is standing water. And whoever did the install on this did a very good job doing it. It's This house does sit up above the street a little bit, giving, giving a little bit of a slope to the property. But um, after 24, almost 25,000 sewer scopes now, the average line that gets out there pushing around 100 feet, if not just a little bit before that, most of them will, I mean, probably 80% or better, will have a belly in the line somewhere. So this was a this is a very well installed sewer line. It's not an easy thing to grade a hundred foot line and not have any of it settled. I tend to change up how I look at things when you have a line this length. It's just the likelihood that you're going to have a perfectly graded sewer line goes down quite a bit. Anyway, water's still moving to the pipe there. You can see that. I wanted to point that out. It's not sure what's going, what's draining in the house right now, but it just doesn't want to stop. Could be a toilet flapper that doesn't shut all the way or something like that. So the, that set of turns right there is as the line is turning to wrap around the, the kind of back left corner of the house. Yeah, it might be worthwhile checking, see if you have any toilets in the house that run. We, I shut the sink off like, I mean, a good 10 plus minutes ago. You might have a flapper in there that just does not like to close all the way. And some toilets will do this, they'll, they'll run really light duty like this for a while until the flapper finally shuts. But just for the sake of your water bill, that's something probably worth looking into. All right, we're now going backwards here, and everything from this point forward is all exposed piping in the crawl space. Looking good going back to the foundation. No standing water, nothing. All that water there you're looking at is still moving. Great looking line, good flow end to end, very clean sewer to boot. All the pipe is in good condition. There is hardly a thing about that sewer line I can nitpick. No offset joints, bellies, anything. And super clean, you rarely get all those things together. That's a great looking line. Sewer line is functioning properly at this time. So there's your AC unit, there's the clean out. The line wraps around the left side of the house. Once it gets up to the front left corner, it turns. And when it, by the time it, it turns to straighten out and run out into the road, it lines up almost perfectly with this door. When I was out there in the street looking back at the house, that's right what I was looking at there, that door. 